to one of the very, very important aspects of what we do is timber management. That's what pays the bills. Growing trees is a long-term proposition, and so you have to have that long view, which as a forester is kind of second nature. And a lot of times our management is really mimicking Mother Nature, and a lot of what we do is small openings and a light touch. You can actually use timber harvesting wisely to improve the overall health and quality of the forest. The timber revenue that we generate from harvesting on public lands provides for a, a whole array of recreational benefits. Harvesting of timber, if done correctly, will actually increase the growth of the forest. It makes it much healthier forest. I explain it to a lot of people, it's kind of like weeding the garden. We also are quite low impact. We, we utilize a lot of harvesting technology that are uh, machines that do not impact the land itself. You're creating more space for the, the more valuable trees to grow. Forests are not static uh, in nature. They do not stay the same way if left alone. With certain management techniques, we can actually create a forest that is healthier than if it had been left alone. It's nice to work for a company that cares about the future of the forest, and also the wildlife in the forest, good group of people. They want it to look pleasing when you look into the forest, but we can also cut some of it too and we can put people to work. That's important to me. A lot of things happen before you even set foot on the ground. We have this base knowledge that a forester uh, really look at before going on the ground. So he already has a pretty good feel about what he's gonna find out there. When you go out there, you try to find, okay, what's out here that, that, that's missing? status of the forest and the stage that it's in will dictate pretty much our action. 